Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we'll be talking about the Android 14 update for the OnePlus Nord 3. So Nord 3 was uh, a mid-range device launched a uh, uh, few months back in India and worldwide. Now uh, it has got the Android 14 update along with uh, the Oxygen OS 14. So it came up with the Android 13 and the Oxygen OS 13 out of the box. Now we have the uh, latest version of Android that's Android 14 on this. So let's just go to the about phone. And you can see here about device official version android 14 so this is being rolled out in india but this is not the uh, this is not a general rollout it's not it started so it will come in the coming days it will be uh, rolling out to all users but we have got the official version here you can see here uh, there you go official version android 14 and uh, you can also see here version android 14 and uh, the other other things available here so let's talk about what all comes inside this version what all features it offers so here if you look at uh, the about version you can see here uh, the regular options what we have seen on other oneplus devices with oxygen os 14 fluid cloud then file doc uh, content extraction smart cutout then shelf is improved improved photo and uh, video related permissions uh, uh, performance optimizations then uh, you also get uh, options like uh, uh, Aquamorphy design and uh, the themes and new uh, always on display etc. So these are available for carbon tracking. Uh, so let's uh, go and see what all features it offers and uh, how it looks. So let's begin. So before that if this is your first time on this channel do hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So let's begin. So let's first uh, see uh, the new fluid cloud. So fluid cloud basically is uh, uh, you get uh, a notification here so we'll just uh, show you here timer uh, start the timer and if i just minimize it uh, you can see this is the fluid cloud small notification this will uh, work for uh, smaller areas like uh, the call timer uh, then uh, stopwatch and if you just uh, press and hold you can expand this i uh, will just show you that as well so you can see here expand it and uh, you can uh, see this running you can just swipe here if you want uh, a full fledged option you can just tap on it and it'll get back the full option so this is the fluid cloud uh, option then if you look at the ui experience the aquamorphic design it looks very nice uh, pretty neatly arranged that's something which uh, we have been uh, really liking uh, the ui definitely looks good uh, neatly arranged and the icons have been given a really good uh, feel all together so you do get all the features and additionally if you go here uh, there is special features and uh, we have the smart sidebar option so uh, let's enable uh, the smart sidebar so once you enable you get this option uh, uh, this uh, file doc option so file doc is basically a kind of a clipboard area where you can uh, save files uh, like sc uh, screenshot um, uh, options or any other clipboard options can be shared uh, here and you can share it to other apps as well and also you can uh, uh, share across other oneplus devices if you are using the auto sync option so that's the file doc functionality so we'll just show you file doc how it works so I just uh, take a photo here and then I just uh, select uh, and I, you can just uh, drag here and you can see here there is an option to file doc. So now I have uh, uh, enabled the photo uh, to file doc. So I can see here the file doc if I select a file doc you can see that photo here now you can go to any other account or other any other app and then drag and uh, uh, paste uh, that photo onto that app uh, that's very easy you can do it across uh, oneplus devices if you are syncing with that account so that option is also there so that's something which is pretty good so uh, you can actually sync across devices if you have uh, uh, if you are using the oneplus account so that's the file doc functionality so there you go so that's the file doc now apart from that uh, let's see another useful feature the smart cutout feature so what you can do is i just take a picture and i can just press and hold and i can see that smart cutout i can save as a new uh, file or if I, if you want i can just drag and uh, drop to the file doc or i can save as a new file so this is the smart cutout and you can see that now uh, i have uh, cropped it and cut it out and uh, you can see this is different uh, file so this is the smart cutout option so this, that again works pretty well on uh, this device again uh, uh, a feature which has been there on other oneplus devices as well so that has been uh, made available in the mid-range oneplus nord 3 as well so that's the file doc and uh, the new features uh, the smart cutout functionality then let's uh, go to the always on display so let's just take the always on display so there you go always on display and here you can see here carbon footprint 
So you can see here walking 10,000 steps instead of uh, using other modes of transport can reduce the emission. So basically if you walk uh, with the phone, uh, it will count the steps and uh, will tell you how much of uh, carbon footprint, uh, carbon emission has been reduced uh, by using uh, uh, different modes of transport like uh, walking. So that uh, uh, is available here. So there are three options uh, if you want to choose. So those options you can choose uh, in the always on display. Then uh, you get uh, the regular options like uh, fingerprint animation, edge lighting, colors, all those options are there uh, to customize, uh, then change icon, theme support. So those few options are not changed, it's uh, the same options which you have seen uh, previously as well. Then uh, another uh, option is the shelf. Uh, so you can see here, uh, shelf has been improved with a uh, new widgets added. So you can add uh, more widgets here. So it has been improved here. So you can see here. Uh, better widgets and also a better usability of the shelf area uh, can be done using this uh, so that is another change happened uh, with uh, the new ui and apart from that there are a lot of performance improvement as well uh, so if, if you look at uh, the multitasking that also has been improved then uh, memory management ram management everything has been improved here so that's one good thing uh, what oneplus has done uh, with the new ui apart from these new features as well so apart from the uh, these additional features like the smart uh, uh, cutout uh, file doc uh, then uh, this uh, fluid cloud so these are the basic uh, new changes happening in the ui uh, along with android 14 optimization which has come on this device so that was the new changes to the oneplus nord 3 in terms of android 14 and uh, oxygen os 14 so hope uh, uh, you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day